Hi everyone, it's Andrea. Welcome back to the channel. Today is a colour and chat. So, let's put this quick disclaimer, this is an adult channel and the videos are made for adults are in no way or shape or form made for children or intended for children. Uh, so we're going to be carrying on with Ladies of Nature. This will be the last one now because we're very near the end as you can see. Um, we've only got a few little bits to do with the berries around there to do and uh, berries on her earrings and her necklace and the daisies. And that's it. And I'm wondering what colour to do the berries. Should I do them red? Should I do them green? I think I'll probably do them red. I'll pick another red. So we're going to do under the mushroom as well. So I'm just going to find the right colour for under the mushroom. I think sort of. Um, hmm, that's too pink. Maybe this colour. What colour is this? This is beige sienna. I'm just going to give it a sharpen. And we'll get cracking. So I'm sorry this has taken uh, so long to do. I've not been feeling too well again. I'll tell you what. And I've been really busy. And to be honest, it's the one thing that gets put out of the way is, or forgotten or not done, is the colouring charts because they take up quite a long time to film. So I do apologise. And we will be starting a new one very, very soon. I haven't decided what book to start to do next, but... Um, I have got plenty, so <laughs> I'm sure I'll find something. I mean, I was going to do one in um, one of the Maria Troll books, so maybe we'll do that one. I can't remember which book it was, though. I'll have to have a look. But we'll do that next. So I've got three of her books, and I can't remember which one I've pulled. Never mind. So... First of all, how are you all? I hope you're all keeping very, very well. Um, looking after yourselves and taking, you know, it one day at a time, not overdoing things. So I want to say hello to all the new subscribers. Welcome for, welcome to the channel. Thank you for joining me. If there's anything you want to see based on what I've previously posted, please leave a link down below and I'll be happy to provide an update of course you know and, and do some videos if you like the Marilyn videos and you want a Marilyn book review have a look at the Marilyn uh, list and, and you know the Marilyn collection video there's a few more since then but please you know let me know if there's anything in there you want to see me review or do a flip through of um, if there's any colouring books that I haven't got a flip through of um, up on the channel, uh, let me know. I may have one filmed and it, you know, may be waiting to go up or I may not have filmed one because I didn't always, I don't always film them. And if you want to see <coughs> a flip through of uh, any of the colouring books that I haven't done a flip through of, let me know again down below and I'll do it. And obviously welcome back to all my other subscribers who have been with me for a while. I appreciate every single subscriber and I'm happy to have you all here. So you will be seeing this on Monday. Normally that's um, the day that I put up my weekly vlog. So you'll be getting two videos today. You'll have already had the weekly vlog but you'll be getting this one today because I did mean to do it on Saturday night but I was busy starting the um, next first impressions video which will be up on Tuesday. Now originally the first impressions video you would have had on Tuesday was going to be uh, the first part of the castle arts one. However yesterday the new Black Widows arrived, the Monarchs, so I will be putting up, I've already filmed the first bit, I'll be putting up the first half of the Monarchs picture. Uh, video. So first impression, so it'll be two parts. We'll be doing the swatch first and unboxing and swatching and then we'll be doing, I will be colouring a picture and as always I show you the picture we're going to be colouring at the end of it. So it's all good fun. So yeah, I was very happy to get them yesterday. I ordered them Friday and they literally did come next day. Um, I will also be receiving, I think it's supposed to come tomorrow, it's coming by DPD, is the new Hannah Carlson book. I could have got it, the the, the foreign edition, um, previously, but I thought, nah, I'll just wait for the English one. I pre-ordered it ages ago. I thought, oh, I might as well wait for it. 
because when I noticed that I could have got that one it was, it was only a week till the release of the English language version in the in, in the UK so I thought oh, I'll just wait for that as I know a lot of people have already used it and done flip throughs I haven't so tomorrow I'll be filming hopefully filming that because um, we'll do it and we'll look at it together because I have not seen it yet I've seen bits of it I try not to look at flip throughs of books that I know I'm going to buy because I like to see the pictures myself for the first time so I'm looking forward to getting that so that's supposed to come tomorrow so hopefully it will I've got to be honest I've not been bothering with eBay very much to be honest I've got too much going on um, and Jennifer's been funny with her sleep and it's our fault because the weather's been terrible it's been hard to get out in the for walks and stuff but uh, what we're going to do is um, she'll go back to nursery my plan for eBay is I've I've made my um, fees for this month I'm in profit it's not a huge profit I want more profit than that but I'm in profit so that's all I care about. What I will do next month is I'm going to book a few days off. I've got a load of holiday to book. Oops, I've gone off the screen. Hang on, let it focus in. I'm going to, yeah, book some holiday um, tomorrow with my manager. And then I'll um, take off a few mornings when she's back in nursery and I'll really wallop it. So... The plan will be on the first day to get everything photographed. There's not a huge amount, to be fair, to photograph of the clothing. It'll be finish off the clothing, sort the shed out on the first day. I mean, I might do a bit before then. I've got a few things to list, so I must get on with them. And then I'll be doing the... Um, I, I missed a bit of red down here, so I'll do that afterwards. Don't know how I missed all that, but there you go looks a bit weird maybe that's why I left it I don't know what it is anyway there we go that's that bit done I'll do the uh, little berries now I'll put that one back. a few gaps here I think that's because that one I don't know anyway uh... that other one I used on here wasn't it let's just uh, do that there there we go just finish that bit off and I think I'll use the, hmm, this one's broken crimson so let's see if I can get a point on it where's the thing um yeah and then I'll just sort the shed out and then I because I can't get to my box of cameras to try and um testing photographs and there's so much stuff in there there's a few board games I need to sort out so I might do those um, yeah, so I'll do those board games and then I'll uh, I'll check them and if I can I will get those photoed and listed I've got some games, I've got two orders to pull I know somebody asked for a haul when I do one when I get some stuff nice but I've got to be honest I have not been going out and um, searching for things um, what I've been buying I've been buying in bulk on, on online um, either via an auction site um, an auction house which is in Cardiff and to be fair there was stuff in there this morning I could have quite happily picked up but I just thought well I've got a lot of stuff to get through if I can get through the stuff I've got and get it all drafted then what I'll do is if I can get it all drafted I'll then do the have a look and if there's something I want I will I will get it you know that's that's the plan if there's something interesting I'll try and get it then um I just don't know there's not been much lately so to be fair there hasn't been very much in the auctions I've wanted so there were some cameras to today I could have gone for but I got so many cameras I'm like do you know what no 
put what you've got up first and then look to get more stock from the auction house. So that's my plan to try and list everything I've got and then if I do do an auction haul or I do go and get some stuff from the auction house I can haul it properly and um, film it for you. I always loved it. I thought people weren't finding it particularly interesting they didn't get a huge amount of views and um, I'm not sure what these are down here though. I might just do them pink along with the daisies and there's some green in there. I think it was, oh, I'll use this one I think on this one. So I'm just going to have to see about what I can get for the, um, yeah. There's a couple of berries I've missed, so I'll just get those. Yes, it's hard to know really. I've got a couple. Um, Jennifer's fine, but her sleeping's been a bit erratic lately. Like I said, it's because we, we can't always get out to to um, get enough exercise so while we can when we can we do but it's very very difficult because when it's hammering down she doesn't want to go out she knows it's wet she knows it's not very nice so for instance the other day Paul went to take her down the park I was doing something in the house um, to play football and to go and play in the play park and as soon as they opened the gate it started hammering down and she wanted to come home so you know what else can you do if she won't and then other times she loves walking in the rain it's really hard to know what to do sometimes because sometimes she just loves the rain you know like all kids she loves jumping in the puddles and but not always so yeah only thing we've got left to do now is the daisy and uh, a bit of background. Have I got the sort of colour I want? Yes, I have, and I've never actually, it doesn't look like it's been used that much. Uh, let's have a look. Pink first. We want a nice pink, bright pink, but not fluorescent. What colour is that? Hot pink. So what I tend to do is, with the daisies, is use two or, two, two or three different colours. Um, let's get out so we'll do this and we'll do this as well here so we'll just put a bit of pink at the top like that a bit of processed red a little bit at the bottom like that we'll do the same on all these just a little bit of pink as you can see it's not too bright even though it's supposed to be hot pink So a little bit on the tip.
missed one. finished with this yet there's a little bit more to do after we finish with this pink okay that's that one and that one in there. don't matter which way they go now and we're just gonna get the little white and we're just gonna blend it in a bit Okay, so for the background, because that's pretty much done, as you can see, what I'm going to do is, because I quite like um, the fact that she's in a forest, I'm going to go in with a dark green. So this isn't a very long video, we're only on 17 minutes and I finished it. <laughs> so what I'm going to just do is I'm going to start at the bottom here. And I'm just going to go in and I'm just going to make it look like she's in the forest. This bit will take the longest. So I won't do it all on camera, I'll finish some of it off. Um, This colour is dark green. It's the nearest I've got to a pine in the prismas. So you could leave it with a white background, but I really hate white backgrounds. Some pictures I like them on, but some of them I think she should be <coughs> hiding in the forest. So she belongs in the forest. And if you're really lucky, you might get to see her. So this is a very short colour in chat today. So I just wanted to finish this off because we'd started it. So I will do the whole of this background like this. So I'll make it as dark as I can get it so that it's not eating into the the lighter greens of the leaves just by layering it like that. quite dark and that'll go all the way around so I'll just come up here and do a bit more around here so I quite like doing this I find doing these sorts of backgrounds quite relaxing just layering you know <clears throat> but, uh, I get back into the swing of it this week I think it's a bit of a shock because <coughs> my job's pretty much back to normal and I'm back on the phones. So, though not on full priority, I mean, I'm, I don't take many calls because I've got Jennifer to look after. So, they, you know, I am allowed to stop what I'm doing to sort her out, but uh, 
generally it's it is quite hard but hopefully she'll uh, she'll be fine so she goes well it's only a week and then she's a week and then Tuesday and then on the Wednesday the second she's going to nursery so and I'm gonna hate it I'm sure I'm gonna miss her very much during the day even though I'm working because I'm at home I'm used to having her running around so there we go so we've only done 20 minutes this is a very short colouring chart so I'm going to take this off now and finish this off screen but that is our lady of nature um, in the what was her name does she have a name do they have names they don't appear to have names so um, but yeah I, re I really really like this one I think she's really pretty and like I said it'll be it'll stand out more when I've done the background it's the darkest green I've got I think yeah it is the darkest green I've got in this set um, I hope you've enjoyed this very 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 quick video and I will see you in the next one cheers guys thanks for watching bye now